Well, I'll tell you what, we sent yeah. one of these things up to MIT. They were uh, using this as a, as a prototype uh -huh. platform for a, for a tracking system for planes. Uh -huh. So they were running FAA coordinates through their own software into our machine and tracking yeah. planes with camera yeah. So that took yeah. five of them for three days to get it out of the box. <laughs> <laughs> We got good enough values. I can draw a chart. I can do an energy graph. I didn't quite get what I expected to get, but I got some very useful information. And so I, I can already predict the competition. What's our uh, what? We're going to win or lose? Well, the Sterling guys are dead. They're tough. You think so? Yeah. Not enough heat, huh? Not enough heat. Not even at one foot away. Not even at one foot away. Um, the we need receptors that convert light in the visible spectrum, especially in the yellow and green and blue. Uh, most of the solar cells run in the deep red to near, ultra, near infrared. So there's going to be some problems. A lot of the climbers are not going to go up at all. How about ours? We may, we, not go, we may not go up very far. We, we may not hit the 200 foot mark? Mm, maybe not. But we'll definitely get going. Yeah. I don't know how far we get. Uh, so what's our uh, what's our maximum wattage at uh, 130 feet away? I haven't crunched my numbers yet. Okay. All right. Sorry. I'll stand here. That way you can't see my face. Well, you look like you look like one of those aliens coming out of a UFO with the yeah. light behind you. I'll take my hat off and the light will shine through my head. Y'all just stick your ear up to the it's, light. It's actually coming. Right it's actually coming out of your armpit. <laughs>